Hold your breath as we journey into the chilling depths of history's darkest secrets. We've uncovered the shocking crimes committed by children that will send shivers down your spine. From innocent faces concealing unspeakable horrors, these tales will leave you both captivated and haunted. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay tuned for more spine-tingling content. Remember, history's mysteries never cease to amaze and terrify. Until next time, keep your lights on and your curiosity burning. Let's start. Graham Young, 1962, known as the Teacup Poisoner, Graham Young started his murderous activities at the age of 14. He poisoned his family members and school friends with deadly substances like antimony and thallium. His actions resulted in several deaths and earned him a life sentence. Amarjeet Sada, 2007, in India, Amarjeet Sada, aged 8 at the time, confessed to killing three children, including his six-month-old cousin. This case raised questions about the impact of a traumatic childhood on young minds. Alyssa Bustamante, 2009, at the age of 15, Alyssa Bustamante strangled and stabbed her nine-year-old neighbor, Elizabeth Olton, in Missouri. She later buried the young girl in a shallow grave. Alyssa was convicted of second-degree murder and received a life sentence. Joshua Phillips, 1998, in Jacksonville, Florida, 14-year-old Joshua Phillips killed his 8-year-old neighbor, Maddie Clifton. He struck her with a baseball bat, and when she didn't die immediately, he later stabbed her multiple times. He hid her body under his waterbed, shocking the local community when the truth was discovered. Craig Price, 1987, in Rhode Island, 13-year-old Craig Price began a spree of brutal killings, taking the lives of four neighbors, including a pregnant woman and two young children. His crimes shocked the community, and he was one of the youngest serial killers in the United States. Lionel Tate, 1999, in Florida, Lionel Tate, age 12 at the time, killed six-year-old Tiffany Eunuch while imitating wrestling moves he saw on TV. He was convicted of first-degree murder and sentenced to life in prison, sparking a national debate about whether children should be tried as adults. Mary Bell, 1968, Mary Bell, an 11-year-old British girl, was responsible for the deaths of two young boys, aged three and four, in Newcastle-upon-Tyne, England. Her disturbing actions shocked the nation, and she was convicted of manslaughter on the grounds of diminished responsibility. John Venables and Robert Thompson, 1993, in Liverpool, England, two 10-year-old boys, John Venables and Robert Thompson, abducted and brutally murdered two-year-old James Bulger. The case shocked the world due to the age of the perpetrators and the sheer brutality of the crime. Jesse Pomeroy, 1872, Jesse Pomeroy, a 14-year-old from Massachusetts, became one of America's youngest serial killers. He brutally murdered and mutilated younger children, earning him the nickname, the Boston Boy Fiend. He was eventually arrested, convicted, and sent to a reformatory. Eric Smith, 1993, at the age of 13, Eric Smith killed four-year-old Derek Roby in upstate New York. Smith lured the young boy into the woods and then brutally beat him to death. His crime shocked the local community and led to significant debates about juvenile justice.